Welcome back. Blue Star Donuts and the Portland Cider Company have a delicious partnership on tap right now. So we have Helen from Portland Cider and Stephanie, the executive pastry chef at Blue Star Donuts here. <laughs> this is an amazing collaboration, which I'm kind of somehow surprised that it hasn't happened already. How did you guys come up with this? <laughs> Actually, it has happened before. What? So yeah. National Donut Day back in 2017, we made a really small batch of our blueberry <gasps> bourbon basil just in the tap rooms, and it sold out in less than two weeks. Holy moly. Yeah, and Are there you... has been a cult following since. So <laughs> Is this going to happen again? Like how much, how limited release is this? This is definitely the limited for this year. We're keeping it around through March is our intention, so we're just going to keep trying to make it. But it has been really popular right off the bat and we're ramping up production to keep flowing the blueberry bourbon basil to everyone. Oh my gosh, I know, because it says on the can, you guys are, you're, you can call it the triple B. There you go, you're looking at it. Blueberry bourbon basil. Does it taste like the donut? Because Blue Star, have you guys always had blueberry bourbon basil? Yeah, the blueberry was uh, our signature donut. It's the one that we, uh, we try and get people to try as their first donut because it's a little bit outside the box. Everybody kind of wants to come in. Not everybody. Lots of people <laughs> come in and they kind of oh, want to. They want to try. They want to try, try the basic donut, and we say, "Don't try the basic. Try the signature." So, it's like Blue Star's version of the basic, like yeah. your basic yeah. level starts there. I feel like we made this donut, and that was the very first one. And then after that, we we're like, "Okay, I guess we should make some other ones." We kind of wanted to just sell this one only and just like <laughs> expose it to the world. But um, yeah, it was great. We did. Uh, we got to go to Portland Cider and kind of taste some stuff and do some some trial runs and add some more blueberry, add some more basil. So it was awesome. It was a fun experience to be able to go and, and test it out and kind of mix it up. Yeah, it so. was really awesome to be able to work hand in hand with doing all the different things, taking some cider out of the barrels, <laughs> putting in some basil, adding some of the fresh Oregon blueberry juice in there <gasps> to make this really great product that ultimately we put in a can. That's so cool. Now, a little earlier in the show, we were, we're doing some very hard work, making some tough calls <laughs> about how many household items we should have. It was difficult. I may have been sweating. <laughs> we have Mikhail Santon from Simple Sweep back over here for now the less difficult job. Oh, this is so much <laughs> more fun. Getting me to organize, difficult. <laughs> getting me to eat a donut and eating one with me and drink a cider. Yeah. Much better. So, okay, I'm excited to see like what color oh, this yeah. is. Yeah, so beautiful. the blueberry Whoa. bourbon basil. Oh. So this is 100% Northwest apples with some Oregon blueberries. It's got some oak aging to give it that blueberry notes. And then we also have just a touch of basil. And it's really pretty. That yeah. sounds so lovely and so fancy and so adult. So where can people actually get the cider? Absolutely, yeah. So you can get the cider. Cheers. Um, yeah, cheers. <laughs> you can get the cider from good. our tap rooms. So we have Portland Cider House on Hawthorne, and then we also have our pub in Clackamas, mm -hmm. where we make the cider. But you can find it at many retailers near you. Fred Myers, a lot of Fred Myers in the Portland area have it. Some Safeways, lots of New Seasons, Zupans, Market of Choices, and just ask for it from your local shop. What do you think? That Michaela? is so good. So oh my good. God, it's so good. It's delicious. It's, it's so not too sweet. No, it's, it's fresh. Tart, but not too tart. And it's fresh. And oh, I love it. Want some? I know you I do. Yeah, oh, yeah, yeah, yes, yeah, yeah. yeah. <laughs> I'm thinking about a donut because I'm just distracted and <laughs> have to keep talking. But Stephanie, you guys do a lot of collaboration donuts yeah. at Blue Star, including one we also featured on the show with Dennis Dixon. Yes. It's very green, Oregon yes. Ducks inspired one. He's my and new best friend. <laughs> I hear that one has been very popular. Yeah, actually I think it's going to become uh, a mainstay for our menu <gasps> for a long time because um, I think it's just a great donut what? and we're really proud and Dennis keeps coming in to buy more <laughs> to share with all of his friends so we kind of have to keep it around if for no other reason than just for him. It's called Matcha <laughs> Matcha Man. Even more fun to eat than it is to order. That's Thank you guys so much and again yeah. go have the blueberry things. Yeah. Bur blueberry, bourbon, <laughs> basil, donut, and cider. Yeah. Now, speaking of football, like Dennis Dixon, do not go away. We will reveal the results of tonight's poll next. So you can go vote right now. Who do you think will win the Super Bowl? Ooh, a lot of Cheers. 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 <laughs>